Stir fry obsessions and me run really deep because it's my saving grace to a quick fix meal. Don't forget to subscribe and hit on the bell icon as I take water chestnuts and fingerling potatoes and create the most fantastic stir fry. As always, the trick here is that you take few ingredients but highly flavorful ones. So into my pan goes in nearly 20 ml of some red chili oil because that's the heat that you want coming right through. As you allow this to get nice and hot, we're gonna take our water chestnuts, a can of them, about 400 grams, and throw them right in. As they stain and get that perfect deep auburn color, it's time to throw the blanched fingerling potatoes in. In goes 500 grams of boiled fingerling potatoes with the skin because I want that flavor of the chili oil to be the first flavor into this. Quick fix, right? So no chopping, no peeling, nothing of that sort. Into this goes a teaspoon of some dehydrated garlic powder, a teaspoon of some dehydrated onion powder, and some dehydrated basil to flavor it. While you can enjoy this just like this, it's near perfection. I want to sauce it up a bit or two. So I'm going to add about 5 ml of dark soy sauce. And lastly, any commercial sauce works. So I'm using black bean sauce. I'm lazy, so about 100 ml of that goes right in. Now I ain't even bothering to garnish this with either some basil or parsley. Just a sprinkling of some Szechuan pink peppercorn sea salt on top. Switch off the flame and dig right into this either with some sticky rice or some steamed rice or any another kind of starch. I hope you enjoyed creating this one with me. So quick, so easy that it doesn't even warrant a recipe and a saving grace to your midweek meals. Don't forget to share loads of love by hitting on the like button. Stay safe, stay blessed and don't forget to leave a note below.